Malham Cove is known to students of geology and geography all over the world. It is in the Yorkshire Dales National Park, not far from Skipton. There is a bus service, rather irregular I might say, so best reached by car or indeed by walking the Pennine Way. There is a car park at Malham which gets very busy at weekends. Malham Cove is a natural rock amphitheatre, with a limestone pavement forming a shelf at the top of the cliffs. A good path from the village brings the visitor to the base of the cove, but should you wish to explore further, boots become essential. From the bottom of the cove there are at least 400 steps to its top and the limestone pavement. An alternative approach is to park at Malham Tarn, which is easier. I don't find so many cars there. After viewing the tarn, retrace steps and take the Pennine Way south to the top of the cove. It is about a mile. The path is quite rough, and there are some steps, but the scenery makes up for any discomfort. From the limestone pavement you have the option to take the steps down to the village, but remember, what goes down must come back up again. Photographically, the trick is to arrive when others choose not to come. Early morning or evenings are obvious choices, but consider winter. When the weather is amiable, perhaps, then the low level of light brings out all the dramatic contours of this amazing landscape. This is a wide-angle lens landscape. Now this will increase depth of field, won't it? And even further, if the light is good. So you won't need a tripod whilst traversing a terrain that requires care underfoot. There is no warning of an approaching edge, so there is more than one reason for good, strong light. As well as combining a visit with Malham Tarn, consider Gordel Scar as an alternative. It can be included in the itinerary. One of my photo walks describes the route, and you will find a link at the end of this program. The big benefit of going to Gordel Scar first is that the path linking it with Malham Cove brings you gradually to the top of the cove. A further surprise awaits intrepid photographers. You only have to go down those 400 steps to the village, which can be trickier than coming up. All photographs are taken with a variety of Olympus cameras and Zuiko lenses. No filters, but save to RAW. The processing is done in Adobe Lightroom.